So today's states, this is a sign for states. Pretty simple. Um, states are very similar to countries in that um, there aren't a lot of them. And the ones that there um, are pretty straightforward. Um, the also, um, if we wanted to know about the signs, we'd actually have to go to that state or find somebody from that. Well, I guess I don't have to travel to Tennessee to find out what Tennessee's sign is. I could probably contact somebody in Tennessee thanks to technology. But So I'd have to find the sign from somebody else. Um, so if you wanted to, to sign about Tennessee, um, you would fingerspell Tennessee, and then you can pick their postal code abbreviation or um, the first three letters of their their name. Like Arkansas, you could go A-R-K. I would finger spell it first and then say oh, Arkansas and then go A-R-K. And then as you go in the conversation, every time you say A-R-K, the person you're speaking, the people or person you're speaking with will know, oh, Arkansas. Okay? That's what I would do with that. Um, Anyway, okay, so let's go and do the signs. Um, Arizona is a hand shape. We can go from left to right. Use I go left to right. Um, Arizona. Washington is W from the shoulder, and this is the best sign, I think. Uh, Washington. So you go Washington. Okay, and Washington, D.C. is Washington, D.C. Woo! Big change. Washington, the state. Washington, the District of Columbia. Okay? Texas is the X hand shape to the right and down. And it, sh um, it mimics the shape of Texas, the uh, smokestack kind of top there. Texas. Okay. Utah. Now, this is the one. Um, you used to see signed here. I just saw this recently. Um, somebody signed it, but recommend don't sign it. It can be very offensive to some people in Utah. Um, that's just the way it is. Oh. You know, it's just the, the way of our times now. We want to make sure everything is politically correct or whatever. So, and most of the time, even though when that was the sign, you know, maybe 10 years ago, people still didn't sign it. They just fingerspelled it, Utah. I just spelled that completely wrong. Utah, U-T-A-H. -A -A <laughs> so that is the new sign for Utah, Utah. Very simple and boring, but that's the sign, okay? Um, Idaho is this. This is also the sign for potato. Um, Idaho grows lots of huge potatoes that are delicious. I love potatoes. Um, Idaho. Idaho. So if you're just going to go, oh, Idaho, 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 you're going to go, oh, potato, potato, potato. So you probably want to designate that, oh, I'm talking about Idaho, the state. Um, otherwise, they'll just pick it up in context clues. It's just like anything else in life. You, reading and such, you just Oh. oh, she must be talking about Idaho, not potato. Okay. California is the I-L-Y hand shape. And you wiggle that, point your finger, index finger, as you come down. And this is the same sign for gold, which makes sense because the California gold rush. Um, gold is for California. New York, Y hand shape, back and forth. Um, there's lots of different reasonings behind it. Oh, this is the subway, or this is a credit card from shopping, or... Is this is the sign for new, and this Y you could use to stand for York, so New York. So lots of different reasons. Doesn't matter. It's the sign. Sign. Oregon is the O, same as Washington. Start at the shoulder and circle out. Whoop, Oregon. Okay. Florida, F L A. Very straightforward. F L A, Florida. Um, Alaska is over and you come to the A. Um, some people say it's a reference to Eskimos. Some people say it's a reference to, you know, those hoods that they wear. Well, not they as in a minority, but they as in people that are cold, you know, with the fur things around their head. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Am I just sticking my foot in it? Um, Alaska, in with an A. Okay. Um, Hawaii is H and you draw like a rainbow because Hawaii, you know, if you've seen their license plates, the rainbow. Hawaii. Um, I think there might be another sign for that one, but I haven't learned that. Uh, it might have changed to be more clear, but this is Hawaii. Um, I'm going to do a, I want to do a campaign where I find 
50 people or people that have been that know these signs from all 50 states to s say what their new and updated sign is or the one that they use the most there because that would be great and when I do I'll totally make a new video saying all 50 states that'd be pretty cool um, so I'll probably have to get that started here soon um, anyway so I hope you enjoy that another short easy lesson um, oh let's do a review real quick um, can't can't go without a review okay and I will hush up so your ears don't keep bleeding. <laughs>